Hey guys, this is the Andrew Sapien. Today I'm going to review the recently launched MI UI 9 on the MI Pad 1. So let's get started. MI UI 9 boasts of many major updates like lightning fast performance and split screen feature. So let's check out what's new in our MI Pad 1. So here's the list. You can see deep level system optimizations, improved image search, simpler home screen editing, smart notification filter, shortcut for frequently used features on the left side of the lock screen. I didn't find any shortcuts. We went and then simplified to include MIUI Labs. Okay, so these are some of the new features. Let's explore these features. The disappointing thing is that even MIUI 9 is based on Android 4.4.4 KitKat, so many features won't be available. Here is something new MIUI Lab. Yes, I've read about this feature of finding photos easily. Wow, even this is not available for me. The layout is same as it was in the MI UI 8. The recent panel is same. The music app is also not updated. And the Explore file manager is also the same. I'll let you know about the battery life. The notification bar is also the same. There's nothing that much new in the MIUI 9 for the MIPad 1. There was also a new way for home screen editing. Let's check it out. Wallpapers are new. But the themes app is again missing. That's not any major update. So you should not have to expect much from my nine if you are holding an iPad one. Here I am using MIUI 9 developer room version 7.9.7 .7, which was released last Friday. If you want to flash it in your MI pad then the link is in the description. You can flash it via the recovery or fast boot method. You can check out the previous video about how to flash stop ROM in the MI pad for further help. I would make a video on gaming performance and battery life of MIUI 9. So stay tuned for more tweaks and awesome customer for the MI pad 1.